Hey Cream Puffs, welcome, welcome back to my channel. My name is QT and today we're just going to be playing some Royal High and somebody just came in here and slept. Alright, so um, I was just at the beach house because I was filming a YouTube video um, with my friend for her channel. Um, Be sure to, s her channel is Lizzie and Jessica Gaming, so be sure to check that out after watching this video. So um, we're just going to teleport. Where should we go to? You know what? Let's. Okay. I'm going to show you guys my farming routine in Royal High. So, what I would usually do is um, I would go to Divinia Park and go to the fountain, but I already did that. And then I would go to my apartments, get my login. I already did that. I got 4,000 diamonds today. And I would go to Earth and <laughs> spin the wheel. Hopefully, I get accessories because I always get diamonds from the wheel. And I know. Um, thinking, hey, Kirti, you get diamonds? That's so awesome. But seriously, guys, after getting diamonds for so long, you kind of get sick of it. So, um, I'm going to be showing you my farming routine in Enchantix High. So, there are, like, a whole bunch of gems there. I definitely recommend being in a private server. So, I'm quickly just going to switch off to one because I just realized I'm in a public server. So, yeah, see you guys in, like, two seconds. Alrighty guys, so I am inside. Uh, I gotta choose my dorm, and honestly, I'm okay. So I'm just gonna go with creative because I love to do art. So yeah, so if you don't have a private server, you can just join your friends like um, I used to do before, and sometimes still do. Um, but uh, yeah, so. As soon as you spawn in, you'll see a couple diamonds here once you go down the stairs, and then one behind here, and one over here, alright? And then there's a bunch, like, not a bunch, but there's one over here, and there's only, like, one in the student dorms, but I'll show you guys where it is. Okay, um, there's also one on the balcony of the student dorm. Uh, just wanted to make sure I didn't miss any. Alright, so the one for the student dorms is, uh, there's three. So, what you're going to want to do is you're just going to come into the student dorms and you're going to go down this hallway right here, which leads to the swimming pool. Ugh, just ignore that. And then inside the swimming pool, there is one pink diamond, which is worth five. Okay, and, oop, oop. Oops, a doopses. Okay. And next, um, I'm just gonna go start over here near the dorms. Um, I'm gonna start at water dorms at the water dorm and I'm just gonna collect the diamonds that I see. Breakfast are being served, let's just ignore that. Okay, um uh, so underneath um music dorm there are a bunch of gems and light dorm also underneath love dorm nature dorm sorry not love nature and then right here at the wings there would be one bright red gem which i just got and it's worth 20 and with multipliers it could be worth even more Okay, so sorry I was sounding so bored, but I'm going to show you a secret location where there's like a whole bunch of jillion, billion, trillion gems. There's like so many gems here. So you're going to want to go to the mermaid pool. All right, just go inside. And as soon as you go in, there's like a whole bunch of diamonds for you. But unfortunately, they're worth one and I don't have any multipliers. So yeah. And there's also tunnels and stuff here, which have a bunch of diamonds in them. Um, I'll go down this one. Oop. So, you just gotta look out for the diamonds, basically. That's literally what you gotta do. Alright. And if you get lost, all you gotta do is reset your character. I just came out of the map. Holy cow. See, if this ever happens, whoa, that is so glitchy. I can see underneath the map. <gasps> that is insane. 
Okay. So again, if this happens to you, you just reset. Okay, it's taking a little while. Okay, there we go. So, um, the diamond spawned back, so I'll just go get it. And then, um, before I get lost again, there's also a bunch of diamonds in the ice realm. And, like, on each side, there's just a bunch of diamonds waiting to be collected. So, I'm just gonna get them. Okay, and over here. Okay. And I believe that's all of them. Like, near the dorms. Uh, okay. Let's go get lost in the pool again. down oh okay uh, it's taking us a little while time to start the day let's start. no thanks okay so the diamonds just respawned for me um i'm just gonna get them and then i'm gonna go down the tunnel again okay So now I know not to go down that rabbit hole. So you just gotta fly for a little bit and then you'll get the diamonds again. Eventually. Did I just miss one? Okay, I thought I missed one. Alright, right here. Uh, oop, right there. Alright, let's go through this. Alright, and we just spawned where we came from. So, let's just go again in the circle. I just keep going in the circle because then the gems will respawn um, at the point once you're done. Like, once you're done, they'll just respawn for you. I collected all these, so they're not there. But, uh, yeah, you just keep going in that circle. I think I took a wrong turn somewhere. Maybe not. Maybe I did. Oh yes, this is the area that I really wanted to find. So, um, you just go on these bricks, I guess, and then voila! There is a diamond waiting for you, followed by a bunch of random bricks with torches. Um, I don't know if Call Me Bob's gonna do anything with this area, or if it was just like random, a glitch, or something like that. But it is pretty cool just to look at. And maybe you can do it for role plays if, like, somebody gets trapped in a dungeon or anything like that. Um, but, yeah. Okay, um, I'm gonna go down the other tunnel I saw once I came here. Um, there was another tunnel with, like, a blue gem. And a bunch of you guys were probably like, Kirti, go there! But I went in the other one. Nope, wrong tunnel. Oop. No, sister, that's the wrong tunnel. And get these. Voila. We're going down the tunnel that some of you guys probably wanted me to go through. Okay. So there's just a whole bunch of diamonds everywhere in these tunnels. I definitely recommend checking it out because you can get rich like super fast. And you're probably wondering, Kirti, why do you have only 2,000 diamonds? I had seven, like, I had over like 20,000. But, um,. I use them. <laughs> I use them on something. I just lost my mind right now. Okay. I use them on something else. I'm going to use them on the skirt. I use it's the something 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 skirt. And then I also spent some on an accessory. Can't remember what it was. But I spent some on an accessory. Okay, um, just go down this tunnel. So many diamonds. But yeah, if you keep going here every single day, you could eventually get super rich. Like, seriously, I mean it, guys. This is how I got my over 20,000 diamonds. Just from going through this tunnel every single day. 
yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to say, because clearly I'm losing my words today. Okay, so this is the brick area. It's a bunch of bricks. Um, this, like, it's all just, like, one big circle. You can never really get lost here. You either just fall out of the map or just go in a circle. Like, I just went in a circle. Um, so, yeah, that's one thing I like about this. It's just that, like, you can never get lost. It's just one big, ginormous circle. Okay, let's get these again. Alright, and then let's go through this one. There's a gem here. Another gem here. And then a gem here. And then let's go over here. It's connected. C, C, C. Connected. It's all a circle. Okay. Um. But that's pretty much what I wanted to show you guys. You cream puffs, guys. Cream puffs. Ugh. It's gonna take some getting used to for me. But, um, let's go find some more diamonds. So, there are literally so many in the Enchantix High School. And by the way, if any of you guys were wondering, like, what's behind the staff only door there? Um, I once glitched through, and it was literally just nothingness. Like, I'm trying my best to glitch through again for you guys, but I don't know how I did it. I don't know how I did it, but I'm trying my best to glitch through to show you guys. But I promise there's nothing there. Like, you just fall down to your death if you go through there. There is absolutely nothing. If you want to die, then go there. Like, if you want, not in real life, guys. No, not in real life. But if you want to, um, just die in game, sort of like resetting, um, then just go there. Make your way through. Do it the non-lazy way. Do it without hitting escape and then R and then R. Well, reset. But, yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna get these diamonds again. But, yeah, that's pretty much what I do to farm and to get, like, a bunch of diamonds. I just go through that loophole a bunch of times, and then I go back out to the main area, and I collect the diamonds near the dorms and all around the map. And eventually, I get rich. So will you guys, if you follow this routine and do it every day, um... I try to do it for about an hour or a half hour or even an hour and a half sometimes as like um, I'm just free and all my friends are busy. So yeah, you guys can eventually get Richamundo. This is Dark Dorm. What's that dorm then? Oh, that's the Tech Dorm. Okay. See, I have so much to learn from this game. For this game, not from this game. For this game. I don't think you can learn much from games unless they're like math games or something. But yeah, so the diamonds that I definitely recommend that you guys get is um, this one up here, which is worth 20 diamonds. Um, there's a yellow one there, which I think is worth two. And then, again, all of the ones that are in the pool. Like the fairy pool. Um... I'm going to go tech, check out the tech dorm. Ooh, maybe creative dorm first. Actually, there's nothing in creative dorm. To use my own water. Um, but, yeah. So, each of the dorms has a, a hidden chest. Or, if it doesn't have a hidden chest, like the dark dorm, um, it most likely has, like, gems that are worth five. Or something like that. Because this it's it's Enchantix High. Come on, people. It's Enchantix High. So, um, honestly, I don't know what else to say. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I'm quickly just going to get these last few diamonds. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mine. They're all mine. Okay, 
uh well guys i'm gonna end this video right here i hope you enjoyed it if you did be sure to smash that like button subscribe to my channel and comment down below what i may be able to play in my next videos and sorry if my voice was just like lazy-ish um i just was like sort of tired also kind of hungry <laughs> So yeah, and I just realized there's diamonds right here over the enchant, no, over the student dorms, I think? Or is this the school? No, over the school, actually. So yeah, I'm just going to get them. Alright, they're all worth one. Now I'm officially going to end this video. So, uh, bye!